if there's one thing AI seems to think about hell, it's that there's a lot of people there. Welcome, 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 welcome. So, is in one of those videos who kuja kwa feed yangu YouTube, so nikona area out here, and uh, this is a reaction channel. Nakonga ni me ni me paste a link ya original video hapo kwa description, so kwa unata kwa angalia, wendo angalia, na yeah, without wasting any time, wacha tuende kwa, tuende kwa vida. One might think hell is a foreign concept to a computer. After all, there's no afterlife for artificial intelligence, right? An artificial intelligence, or AI, doesn't have a soul. Heaven and hell are meaningless to it. But an AI can learn about these things, it can read stories and look at pictures, and as you're probably well aware, a computer can process all this information on a much greater scale than a human. So when an AI has processed all this information, what will it think about hell? After it's consumed vast amounts of human knowledge, will it piece it all together and come to the conclusion that there's no such thing as hell? Will all of our stories and pictures have scared the computer into believing in our version of hell? Or maybe a computer will have an entirely separate idea of hell, its own unique vision. Whatever the case, will this vision be where the AI thinks we go, or where it goes? I asked an AI to show me a vision of hell. This, according to artificial intelligence, is a representation of hell. The AI created what you are seeing right now. This is a computer's idea of what hell looks like. This is a text-to-image AI, meaning I give the AI a written prompt and it creates an image based on that prompt. In this case, the prompt is simply hell, but I'll vary the prompt to produce different versions of hell. I'll put this prompt on screen so you know what the AI was thinking when it created these images. I won't explain exactly how it all works, but the basic idea is the AI processes billions of images from the internet and their descriptions. It analyzes all this data until it starts to learn the correlations between the descriptions and what appears in the images. Eventually, it can create its own images given a description. In this way, the AI is really just showing us a representation of what it thinks humans think hell looks like, because it learned how to portray hell from humans. So I was kind of dramatizing the AI's thought process earlier, but imagining how an AI might think about all this is a fun philosophical game to play while we look at the images it's created. If there's one thing AI seems to think about hell, it's that there's a lot of people there. As you can see, the AI sometimes deigns to put some inspiring words in the images, although they rarely make much sense. I'm using the DForum notebook and Google Colab to generate these images and then upscaling them to a higher resolution so they appear more sharp and crisp. Interestingly, this AI also has the capability to create videos. So why don't we go ahead and dive into the lungs of hell.
I hope you've enjoyed your tour of hell, and I hope you're as fascinated by this technology as I am. This is the cutting edge of artificial intelligence right now, and the images these things can create are amazing. Lots of possibilities here. Maybe I'll do more videos about this stuff if people are interested, or maybe this will be a once-off. Let me know if you'd like to see more or not in the comments. Of course, I have many videos about a wide array of other topics, so you can go watch them if you liked this one, and subscribe for more in the future. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm. um, so you need an AI's version of hell. Um, then you basically have like some magical images from all over the internet. You can compile, you can render, you can get your compilation. So I think. Uh, it uh, a few years ago or a few months up for a while uh we convert uh, descriptions into art form i'm a uh, uh, short uh, videos then we talk to we do tangeneza ni utoka tu vizuri na akamgo mnajua kuliko na an art uh, competition uh say how long ago uh pali an ai lishinda litokea vizuri sana so hii uh, ilikuwa tu a fun video uh where i matter if uh, if you believe or not ilikuwa tu a fun video ni wanta ku react ya so what do you think uh una kadu na kadu vile unaweza fikiria hali inaweza ka but uh, at the end of the day, I would have to a job live. The afterlife in a car. Whether or not uh, there's a hell, uh, depends. The job took it daily. You could have some groups who figure out pass away. If you, are, if you are a good person uh, during the resurrection, at the into the the good people in your rise but if you are had uh, if you are living a bad life but you to stay dead kuna wengine wana believe kuna an after life pari uh, i mean pali utani unajua immediately after usha cross so utajua dio sikutakufa so anyway it was uh, it was a very interesting video and uh, yeah thank you for watching and niambia kama nataka kuwa na moka hizi and uh, see you in the next video okay.